Blog Talk Radio, the world's largest online radio network. Welcome to the Nikki Rich Show, the hottest radio station on the planet. We are here at a special time, special date, broadcasting live from Charlotte, North Carolina, all the way to London. And guys, I'm excited tonight. For those who don't know, it's your girl, Nikki Rich, and we have a special, special treat for you this afternoon. And with no further ado, we're going all the way to London, the 2012 Olympics. And with no further ado, I would like to welcome to the Nikki Rich Show 2004, 2012, two-time co- Olympian and competing in the high jump track and field, none other than Jamie Nieto. Welcome to the Nikki Rich Show. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. I appreciate being here. Yes, we're so glad and we're excited about everything you have going on right now. And we're pumped. <laughs> this is awesome. Now, go ahead and let everybody know a little bit about you. I mean, you wearing so many hats right now. I mean, they know you as an actor, producer, and an athlete, an uh, Olympian. How does that feel? Thank you. Thank you for having me. North Kakalaka, stand up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's yeah, right. Yeah. I know it's right. Now, what time is it over there, Jamie? Okay, so it's like 7 p.m. here, around 7, 10, I think it is. And, uh, you know, the sun's still out, which is cool, and uh, it's, it's, it's feeling pretty good outside, actually. Not too hot, not too cold. I know. How is it feeling, I mean, to be a part of the Olympics? Um, it's it's an overwhelming experience. First of all, I just got to thank God because, you know, it's been a long road. I just missed out on making the Olympic team in 2008, and uh, I made the Olympic team in 04, but once I missed out in 08, to come all the way back to 2012 and make the Olympic team again is just a true blessing. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's just been an overwhelming experience, you know? And that is awesome, and I know it's overwhelming because you're representing the U.S. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah, yeah, now, yeah what so. What do you do to get prepared for this? This is such a a big moment. <laughs> um, you know, it's just a lot of uh, basically fine tuning right now. A lot of ment- mental visualization type stuff. You know, um, that's all you can do. If you don't have it by now, you're not gonna get it. You know, so uh, it's just a lot of fine tuning right now. Whether it be at practice, whether it be you know just staying off my feet trying to rest and stuff. Actually, I'm not off my feet right now. I'm kind of like. It, it, enjoying the experience right now, but I will be off my feet, you know, this next week because we have uh, we have um, our qualifying round on, on on Sunday, which is August fifth, and then our finals round is going to be on Tuesday, which is the seventh. And I've been watching the game, and the U.S. is really, really doing great. They're doing really good. Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah, no, it's it's. It's looking like it's going to be a great game for the United States. And, you know, what I love about you, you just don't stick to one thing. You, you're all over the place. You have, you know, you're an actor as well, and you have the Rob, Roberto Clemente Clement story, and you just yeah, been yeah. working hard on that. And, I mean, how does that feel? Oh, that feels great. You know, it's it's been a, um, a long journey, like I said. You know, in 2008, when I missed out on making the Olympic team, um, I started taking some acting classes. And uh, since then, I've been in five feature films. Uh, i got one on Netflix right now called Encounter, mm-hmm. another one that's uh, went to DVD called Jerusalem Countdown. And then I worked on uh, Baseballs last year or the Roberto Clemente story last year where I actually played Roberto Clemente. And that was an awesome experience. A lot of research, a lot of studying went into that. And then I'm also, like, producing my own web series called Blood Brothers. And uh, people can check that, uh, the new trailer we just put up about a month ago called bloodbrothersweb.series.com. Um, so encouraging everybody to check that out and continue to follow me on Facebook and Twitter. I'm on all that. And you can also check out my website, jamienieto.com, where you get a lot of this information and continue to follow my road and my journey to Olympic Games. Most definitely. And you know, on the on the religion side, we know that you're a Christian, and you have done several interviews with the Seven Hundred Club. 
and oh, other yeah. Christian stations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My spiritual walk is, is you know, is a, is a big thing for me. You know, to be at this level, I don't think I could have made it without God. So I just appreciate, you know, everything that that he's blessed me with and plan to continue to just, you know, keep glorifying his name as always possible, you know? That is real. That is real. And we also know that you have a track camp. Tell us a little bit about the track camp. Yeah, yeah. My track camp is um, it's on um, January 5th of 2013, and I'm basically encouraging, you know, little kids to come out and check it out. As me as a younger athlete, I pick everybody's brain, you know, whether it was like a shot putter, whether it was a hurdler. I asked all these people who are very successful in this in this realm of making Olympic teams and stuff like that, how they did it. So that's kind of the, the theme and the motto of my um of my camp is like, you know, we have a high jumper, we have a, 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 a Jared Rome who's a two time Olympic thrower, we have the Barber twins who are sprinters. I got uh, yes. Dominique Arnold who's a husband. You heard of them? <laughs> Dominique Arnold Yeah, who's a I former actually former. met them. They're friends with my my high school friends, so we all got a chance to hang out for my birthday when uh, when okay. I went to Atlanta. Yeah, yeah. So they're they're great great <laughs> athletes and then we got um we got Akiva McKinney who shows long jump and basically the kids just come out there, they get to rotate and hit every event and just pick the athlete's brain, find out what makes them mm-hmm. so successful because what I tell them might not resonate the way the Barber twins might tell them, you know, and that might really resonate with them and next thing you know they're Olympians type of thing. So um, it's at the Olympic Training Center in Chula Vista, California and I'm definitely encouraging everybody to check that out. Uh, I, I should have my flyer up on my website pretty soon here, but please. Well, we have it up already. Oh, you got it. We have it up on Facebook already. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Yeah, so come on down, and uh, we would love to have you guys. You, you, I think you couldn't get a better camp, you know, um, having so many elite athletes, not only that, but also training at the Olympic Training Center is is definitely a, a huge thing because only Olympians and, and world-class athletes get to train there, you know, so to have kids come out and experience, you know, what mm-hmm. we experience every day, I think uh, would be a great would be a great opportunity for the kids. That is such an honor, you know, for the, the youth to come out and train with the Olympians. I mean, that is okay. amazing in itself. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, no, And then gonna, y'all gonna are work. young. You're young. You're working. You've been working and working, and, and you're young, and you're doing such an awesome job. And you have a global yeah. present. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I, like I said, I've been blessed. I've been really blessed. Um, but, yeah, it's, it's, everything is going really great right now. So, you know, I, I'm just pushing forward and keeping God first on my thing, you know. Exactly, exactly. Well, we're just glad that you took out their time all the way from London to talk with the Nikki Rich Show. And we're going to continue no to follow your movement and – everything you got going on and and we're just so blessed to have you on today okay well thank you i appreciate having me and i and i appreciate uh, all the the retweets and the tweets and getting my my face and my name out there because that that all that helps out you know exactly and i definitely want to thank uh miss gwendolyn and also um holly really rep everybody that had you know helped make this happen today okay yeah definitely uh, I, I got a great pr team and support team so definitely want to give them a great shout out so thanks again i really appreciate it and we thank you for for calling into the nikki rich show much love and we're okay. going to be supporting you and rooting you on over here from the u.s okay appreciate and, it and uh Hello, you hear me? Hello? I'm, we're here. <laughs> we're here. <laughs> well, we'd like to thank you again, and we're just, you know, supporting you all the way, and we just wish you all the best here at the Nikki Rich Show. And I would like to thank everybody for tuning in. We're going to go to the phone lines. I see we got 404. You on the air? Tell us your name and where you're calling from, 404. Hey, Nikki, this is Gary Cross in Atlanta, Georgia. How are you today? 
I'm good. I'm good. Welcome to the Nikki Rich Show. Well, thank you so very much. You know, it's a pleasure to be speaking with you, and I know that you're up there in the wonderful city of Charlotte, North Carolina. Is that right? Yes, we are. <laughs> well, you know, yes, we I was are. listening. I was listening to you speaking to the uh, Olympic champion there, and I say champion mm-hmm. because I guess that's what he's going to be come next week, huh? Oh, yes, most definitely. <laughs> on August the 5th, y'all got to go check him out. Fantastic. <laughs> and remember that, that he was on uh-huh. the Nikki Rich show. <laughs> Right on. That 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 sounds ex- exciting. And I like what he was talking about is that um, you said that uh, he's going to have a training program where he'll be working with the youth and things like that? Yes. Mm-hmm. Most definitely. That reminds me of, um, you know, when the Super Bowl came to town, uh, all of the uh, athletes were doing uh, mini camps and things like that and uh, uh-huh. working with all of the youth as well. So, you know, there's just I, – I love to see athletes giving back to the community. Yes. You know, so um you know, it's it, it's exciting because um we're doing we're doing some exciting things down in Atlanta as well. As you know, I am with the uh, small and home based business chamber of commerce. Uh awesome. as a matter of fact. Yeah. So so we're gonna be doing a major event here in Atlanta on August the fourth, which is next Saturday at okay. uh, two hundred Beach Street. That's uh, what used to be the old Macy's department store. It's now in a beautiful mall and uh, exhibit center. So uh, we're having a Small and Home Based Business Expo 2012. So folks from all over the city, as a matter of fact, you know, we'll be having praise in the park down here at Centennial Park. So they're expecting thousands of people to be downtown Atlanta. So if anyone's yes. in town, yeah, stop by the um, the Small and Home Based Business Expo, and that's uh, shbbusinessexpo.com to learn uh, all about the activities that we'll have. We'll have um, business opportunities. We'll have small businesses who are uh, actively doing their thing. We have all kind of workshops, attorneys talking about how to start and incorporate your business, uh, accounting, bankers talking about uh, how to do business funding and financing, uh, marketing, mm-hmm. Internet marketing. It's going to be an exciting day, and we look forward to bringing this expo up to North Carolina, as a matter of fact. What do you think about that? Oh, yes. Yeah. That sounds great. It sounds great. You know, we're here based out of Charlotte, North Carolina, and it would be awesome that we bring it to the the Carolinas. <laughs> Absolutely. I know I know Charlotte, you guys are doing some tremendous things up there and you know, every time I turn around I know that um uh, Bob Johnson's got the Charlotte uh, what is it, Hornets, is that right? Bobcats. Bobcats. Bobcats, okay, okay. The Charlotte Bobcats and um as a matter of fact I knew him. When he had DET, because I'm originally from Washington, D.C., and, and my junior high school was right next door to DET uh, when they mm-hmm. first got started. So I'm, I'm 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 so proud to see that DET has emerged and doing a tremendous thing these days because, uh, you know, we needed uh, some good programming. And, of course, uh, um, TV One is doing a great job as well. So we got to give exactly. them all the props. But, mm-hmm. but, but let's talk about the Nikki Rich Show because she is on the move. <laughs> Most definitely, we are really, we're really blessed and we're excited because God has tremendously opened doors. I mean, He is slamming doors open here at the Nikki Rich Show. We have over thirty nine thousand listeners right now, and we're just working our way up, and we're gonna get to a (laughs) hundred before you know it. And I'm gonna let the world know. Absolutely. And you know what? You know what, Nikki? I'm going to touch and agree with you on that, that you want to hit 100000 before the end of this year. And, um, yes. Uh, because, because I think that uh, what you're doing is, is tremendous for the local communities and for, you know, um, for the pioneers, for the soldiers that's in the field. You know, uh, mm-hmm. you, you, you're not only going for those who are gold medal uh, contenders, but you're going for those who, um, you know, are brown bag holders, you know, the guys who are, uh, out there in the field every day, catching the bus to work and doing what they got to do. I mean, I've, I've listened to you and and I've read your bio and I understand, you know, your whole philosophy. And I I just my hats off to you because you too are such a pioneer. With um, I I think that you just uh, got a new MBA. Is that correct or what's going on with that? I I didn't hear you. What did you say? I said. I read that you had just achieved some new accolades yourself. Is that right? Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, yes. I know, I'm, just, I know I'm, going, I'm putting you on the spot, huh? 
<laughs> yeah. Interview the interview week. Oh, come on, come on. Stop being so modest. And tell us, tell us uh, was it a phoenix? Are you a phoenix? Is that what's happening? Yes. Um, I graduated from my undergrad from USC, upstate of South Carolina. And um, I have my B.S. in criminal justice and education, and I have my master's in business administration and um, from Phoenix, um, working on my second year Ph.D. Oh, in yeah, business baby. administration. <laughs> hey, Most definitely. Well, I'm all over the you place. <laughs> you're, 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 but you're a blessing, you know. And and I tell you what, uh, and you're focused, and it just goes to show uh-huh. that. Um, Anything the mind can conceive and believe, it can achieve. Mhm. Would you agree with that? Yes. Anything, Anybody. I mean, if, if God be for you, if God be for you, no thing can be against you. So, um, you know, that's, mm-hmm. it's just it's a blessing to talk with you and to you know acknowledge uh, your growth and your and your uh, expansion, uh, but most of all, how you give back to the community and. Uh, I tell you what, for all of the listeners out there, I would encourage them to uh, call their other friends and family. And, and I know that whenever you go on online, you always email us and let us let I, I should say yes. on the air, you, you always email us and let us know. So um, mm-hmm. um, why don't you do me a favor, uh, and, and if I don't mind, if you don't mind, tell us your website so we can go and um, and know how to find you when you're doing your thing. Well, anybody, you can go to several different websites. Um, you, we are all over the place. You can go to iTunes. Every episode of the Nikki Rich Show is in iTunes, and you can download it for free. You can go to NikkiRichShow.com, the official website, where you can learn about anybody who has been a part of the Nikki Rich Show. And you can find all the information you might need. We have promotional services that we do offer to everyone, such as advertising, sponsoring, and so forth. You can also go to blogtalkradio.com forward slash The Nikki Rich Show, where you can hear the actual show during that time from 7.30 to 9.30 p.m. Eastern, Monday through Friday. And you can find us on the syndicated network, 98.2 to be L.A., because we are broadcasting live from L.A. Also, um, Mix Show Blast, as well as Star Force Hip Hop. And you can catch us on College Underground Radio. And you can log on to collegeundergroundradio.com. And you can find us there, and you can listen to any of the Nikki Rich shows 24-7. And you can listen to Nikki Rich show, period, 24-7 throughout the day. So you can listen to all our episodes. And we do have several episodes on our YouTube channel, which is youtube.com forward slash Nikki Rich 2. And we got some of our episodes with the exclusive interview with Master P mm. on there. So... You can check us out anytime. You 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 were right when you said you are all over the place. I mean, good gracious, I couldn't keep up with that. <laughs> yes, we have so many avenues where we're being heard, and and as well as several of our guests have come on, and they have also put embedded our um, show on their website, so you can also go hear the our show on their website as well. So any of our guests, they do that all the time. So. That's where we at. We're we're worldwide. We're global. <laughs> hey, you know, I tell you what, um, my hat's off to you. As a matter of fact, um, I was wondering if you were going to be going on TV, and I heard you say that uh, you 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 have um, your YouTube thing, and I know that YouTube is blowing up, and uh, YouTube is a phenomenal medium as well. So, um, you know. I just want to say thank you for an opportunity to call in and speak with you. And if it's okay, I'd like to say one more time that uh, here in Atlanta on August 4th, uh, the Metro Atlanta Home-Based Business Chamber of Commerce will be conducting the 2012 Small and Home-Based Business Expo. So anybody that's in Atlanta or planning on being in Atlanta on next Saturday from 10 a.m. until 6 p.m., please take a look at SHB businessexpo.com and come on by and spend some time with us and our philosophy Nikki is that every home should have a business 
And when every home has a business, we can then start teaching generational wealth and we can learn how to write off the car expense and electricity expense and some of the groceries and all those expenses that we're spending money on actually can come back to us in terms of revenue and, and, and tax uh, deferred uh, expenses. You, you follow what I'm saying? And I know you know that because you're an MBA. So, you know, I'm teaching oh, yeah. to the choir now. Is that right? <laughs> Absolutely. Yes, so listen, sir. I'm gonna jump off, man. I don't want to, um, you know, hog up all your time. But oh, it's a pleasure. It's a it's a pleasure and a blessing. So just a thanks for allowing me to, to to speak with you for a few minutes, okay? Thank you so much. This, this is Gary Cross calling from Atlanta, Georgia, hot Atlanta. <laughs> much love to you. Much love. Awesome guys, you are just listening to our callers. They calling in right now. And we just spoke with our special guest today, uh, Olympian, two-time, 2004-2012 high jumper. You know him, Jamie Nieto, representing the USA. Right now, we're going to go to the phone lines. We're going to go to 323-371. Tell us your name and where you're calling from. That's me. Okay. Yeah, it's Nikki Rich, it's this Damien Love out in California, representing Jamie Nieto, the high jumper. Hey! <laughs> Welcome to the Nikki Rich Show. Yes, yes, yes. Is, is Jamie still in, or is he is he already um getting ready for it all? Yes, he's already. He just stepped out. <laughs> He just stepped out. We was, on, we was on hold. We was trying to be in, be in Siobhan. His um, team Nieto is um, here listening in. We was trying to see okay. what's going on on the Nicky Red Show. Siobhan, you yes. there, right? I'm here. Hey. Welcome to the Nicky hey, Red Show. Hey, how you doing, Nicky? Good. We're glad to have you guys on. Oh, definitely. Yeah. You know, we're all here fans of Jamie, definitely fans, uh, former runners, know the Nick Barber twins. We're all tuning in and just as ready to hear more about Jamie and his experience over there in London. Awesome, awesome. Well, we just we just got off air with uh, Jamie. We just spoke with him. He just came through for a little bit, and we just talked need- with him okay. about Huh? We need more. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> well, I, def- well, I definitely know wanted. I, I definitely wanted to shout out because um, Jamie had a short amount of time. His um his web series is coming out that that's actually out on YouTube right now. It's called Blood Brothers. We, you guys didn't get a chance uh-huh. to talk about it, but that's like a huge, huge part of what you know, Jamie's. Jamie's doing right now in his career, along with his Olympic journey, and he has some phenomenal stuff. This is like a new chapter for him, and we definitely want to support, you know, our, our Olympic athletes, you know, because a lot of times they don't always get all the credit and stuff that you know that basketball players get, football players get, and you know, U.S. Exactly. sports. Exactly. But you know, Jamie's and that's been why doing we had it. to have him. On. We had to have him on today because, like you said, they don't get the accolades that they should because. I mean, this is just amazing journey to even just go to the Olympics, you know, be in the U.S. and represent us. It's just amazing. You can't get no better. Exactly, exactly. So, yeah, so any everybody listening, definitely go check out com. The last name is spelled N-I-E-T-O.com. And then definitely check out his Blood Blood Brothers project because it's definitely something that's going to be moving right like right after the Olympics. He's going straight into that. So right now we're really focused on the gold. We want to get the gold. So he's out there doing it. There's going to be a lot of pictures that are going to be coming out, video video feeds. He's going to be doing mm-hmm. some interviews and stuff out there in Europe. Um, he'll be tuning in as well. Maybe we'll get him back on the you know Nikki Rich show and give an opportunity to talk about what's going on like right right in the midst of it if possible we'll have to look into that cuz you know I know he definitely appreciates the support and everybody you know rooting for team USA and team team Nieto so yes uh, and it's it's so amazing that we can talk you know with Skype it's free and you can talk as long as you want <laughs> that's what I right. love about the this connection here and it's amazing 
Friday. Yeah, now. yeah. We we have a really strong, you know, re- we want to get a really strong support for our athletes and make sure that, you know, if they come back with gold, if they don't come back with gold, they're all Olympians. You know, everybody, pretty much anybody that's an athlete has had to go through track and field to get where Jamie is. Like Jamie's done bas- basketball, and he's done track for, you know, most, most of his life. He's, you know, two-time Olympian, won a number of championships, incredible Christian, incredible individual, great, you know, public speaker, all these things. And that's that's definitely what you know myself and Siobhan and 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 Gwen Gwendolyn um, PR that have really you know pushed behind to make sure that all this all the things that Jamie is about people really get to know him, you know, because he's a phenomenal individual. And then there's other athletes as well that are out there doing the same thing, representing the United States. All these things. And that's, that's definitely what you know. And that is awesome. About. That is awesome. And we're going to continue to support Jamie and all of you guys. We're going to keep everybody updated on the Olympics and what's going on. We're going to be, continue, you know, watching and just cheering them on. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So I definitely appreciate it. Javon, did you have anything you wanted to share? No, definitely. Definitely appreciate the opportunity Nikki has given Jamie all the way from London. And just, um, you know, say to everybody to tune in and watch the high jump on August 5th. And the final is on the 7th. So we can all cheer Jamie on and give him all his support. Did you have anything you want to share? Exactly. Yeah, send him some tweets. Uh, Got to send him some tweets. <laughs> yes. I know y'all, we, we have really been going hard on them tweets, too. <laughs> yeah, you have. Yeah, you have. <laughs> it is going crazy. And we definitely crazy. appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and we hope to, you know, be in the midst of it. If y'all can call in, um, we hope to be in the midst of it as well, you know, once he gets gets it going. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, if if he's not able to, I can, you know, I'll call in and, and we we stay uh, in communication through Skype or text or whatever. I just check yes. in on him. Uh, we're part of his, you know, management and marketing team and everything. So we really keep, you know, keep everybody up to date. Um, we actually have his Facebook fan page, and it's really easy. His first and last name, Jamie Yetto fan page. And people can join there, and there's going to be exclusive pictures, updates on what's going on. After he wins the gold, it's going bananas. I'm, I'm calling it, it out is. now. It's, it's going, going bananas. It's going to be crazy. It's going to be bananas. And we're excited. We're pumped because we know it's going down. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So we got we to get everybody to get on board with Team, Team Nieto. And it's Team Nieto on uh, Twitter. And then you can you can chime in and just you know wish him good luck you know send him blessings he loves the you know the blessings the prayers the you know the mm-hmm. inspiring words the encouragement the support of all the United States it's just not just like oh well you know he's from Sacramento or he trains in San Diego and went to um, EMU you know it's about the United States he's representing all of us. You know, everybody that's out here that's, you know, working really hard to be an athlete, to be an entertainer, to go after their dreams and be inspired, you know. Yeah, uh, Siobhan, what's that, what's that quote on him that he has on, um, on the Facebook page? That your only limitation is yourself. You said, what is it? Your only limitation is yourself. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. I'm I'm going down my timeline, and I'm just looking at my tweets, and y'all got me crying over here. (laughs) (laughs) Trying to get your attention. Where's some Jamie at? Where's my Jamie at? Where's my hops at? (laughs) Oh, gosh, y'all got me crying. (laughs) But we um, are... fans to tune in and let Jamie know that they heard his interview on the Nikki Rich show, you know, giving him that support and to keep their eyes on the middle of the field, you know, on that high jump, you know, so it's definitely going down and we just thank everyone for their support. And it's August the 5th, correct? Correct. Yes. August the 5th, it goes down and we're going to be watching. 
And the finals is August the seventh, so you got to check your local your local listings um, on NBC. I know they got MSNBC, uh, ESPN is covering it, CNN is covering it, and I'm sure you know um, during the medals they do all the interviews and stuff like that. So be able to tune into all that stuff as well. And then online, you actually have um, I think it's London um, 2012 as well. London 2012.com. Um, NBC has one. And there's USA USA Track and uh-huh. Field on Twitter. Like you can just, actually, you can just you know you can tr- go for the trend and look for um, Team USA, and then scroll down okay. in the timeline, and you'll be able to see some of this stuff. Team Nieto, we we also promote other athletes and stuff like that, so you get to know some of the other athletes. Jamie's verified, so you know that it's him and it's not somebody else. So you'd be able to make sure that you're getting to the right person too. Most definitely, and we're gonna we're gonna be putting out this interview as well, and it's gonna be on iTunes and all the other avenues that we're a part. And we want everybody to know about Jamie Nieto and everything he got going on. Absolutely, stay tuned. Definitely, and we're gonna we're gonna be putting out this interview as well, and it's gonna be on. And I I hear the echo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got a little but, theme. <laughs> but we thank you guys for, and feel free to you know tune in to us anytime Monday through Friday from seven thirty to nine thirty p.m. Eastern. We air, and on um, LA time, we air from five to six. Okay. Okay. Yes, well, you sir. know we definitely we we know you know we definitely support the Nikki Rich show. And we thank you. We thank you so much for you know just you know supporting us because if it wasn't for you guys, we would not be here. We would not be here. And I'm truly, truly blessed to have you supporting the Nikki Rich show. Absolutely. Well, all right, you continue to have a blessed day, and thank you so much again from Tim Nieto. And you guys keep doing the London 2012, Jamie Nieto, the next Olympic gold medalist. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And, guys, right now you are just listening to Team Nieto. Shout out to Team Nieto, USA Olympian, two time Olympian, 2004. 2012, so support him on August 5th. August 5th, be on the lookout. And right now, we're going to go to Mary Mary. Go get your blessing. Go get it, Jamie. It's yours. It's like you're looking through a telescope. You see where you're going to be. Growing, getting... Blog Talk Radio, where millions of hosts and listeners gather. Track and field, none other than Jamie Nieto. Welcome to the Nikki Rich Show. Thank you. Thank you so much for having me. I appreciate being here. Yes, we're so glad and we're excited about everything you have going on right now. And we're pumped. (laughs) This is awesome. Now, go ahead and let everybody know a little bit about you. I mean, you wearing so many hats right now. I mean, they know you as an actor, producer, and an athlete, an uh, Olympian. How does that feel? Thank you. Thank you for having me. North Kakalaka, stand up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's yeah. right. I know it's right. This is such a... A big moment. 
Um, you know, it's just a lot of uh, basically fine tuning right now, a lot of ment- mental visualization type stuff. You know, um, that's all you can do. If you don't have it by now, you're not going to get it, you know. So uh, it's just a lot of fine tuning right now, whether it be a practice, whether it be, you know, just staying off my feet, trying to rest and stuff. Actually, I'm not off my feet right now. I'm kind of like enjoying the experience right now. But I will be off my feet, you know, this next week because we have uh, – we have um, our qualifying round on, on, on Sunday, which is August 5th, and then our finals round is going to be on Tuesday, which is the 7th. And I've been watching the game, and the U.S. is really, really doing great. They're doing really good. Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah, no, they, it's 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 looking like it's good. Now, what time is it over there, Jamie? Okay, so it's like 7 p.m. here, around 7, 10, I think it is. And, uh, you know, the sun's still out, which is cool, and uh, it's, it's, it's feeling pretty good outside, actually. Not too hot, not too cold. I know. How is it feeling, I mean, to be a part of the Olympics? Um, it's, it's an overwhelming experience. First of all, I just got to thank God because, you know, it's been a long road. I just missed out on making the Olympic team in 2008. And uh, I made Olympic Team in 04, but once I missed out in 08, to come all the way back to 2012 and make the Olympic Team again is just a true blessing. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's just been an overwhelming experience, you know? And that is awesome. And I know it's overwhelming because you're representing the U.S. <laughs> That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, now, yeah, what, so. what do you do to get prepared for this? It's going to be a great game for the United States. And, you know, what I love about you, you just don't stick to one thing. You, you're all over the place. You have, you know, you're an actor as well, and you have the Rob, Roberto Clemente Clement story, and you just yeah, been yeah. working hard on that. And, I mean, how does that feel? Oh, that feels great. You know, it's it's been a, um, a long journey, like I said. You know, in 2008, when I missed out on making the Olympic team, um, I started taking some acting classes. And uh, since then, I've been in five feature films. Uh, I've got one on Netflix right now called Encounter, mm-hmm. another one that's uh, went to DVD called Jerusalem Countdown, and then I worked on uh, Baseballs last year or the Roberto Clemente story last year where I actually played Roberto Clemente. And that was an awesome experience. Blog Talk Radio, the world's largest online radio network. Welcome to the Nikki Rich Show, the hottest radio station on the planet. We are here at a special time, special date, broadcasting live from Charlotte, North Carolina, all the way to London. And guys, I'm excited tonight. For those who don't know, it's your girl, Nikki Rich, and we have a special, special treat for you this afternoon. And with no further ado, we're going all the way to London, the 2012 Olympics. And with no further ado, I would like to welcome to the Nikki Rich Show 2004-2012 two-time Olympian and competing in the high 